Hey guys, welcome to my beauty channel. My name is Damzola and this is just the right channel for you. So I want to say a big thank you to all of you that took our time to subscribe to my channel. Thank you a lot. If you haven't subscribed yet or you're new to this channel, please just click that subscribe button. Like this video, so don't post notification. Tell me something great at the comment section. Please, it's very important that you like this video, okay? <music> into what i have for you guys today so i promise you guys that this year i'm going to do a lot of comparison video and trust me i'm not lying at all so today i'm going to do a comparison video on kojic sun soap and nano extract white soap so i hope you guys like this particular content because at the end of this video i'm going to be telling you guys how to differentiate the fake nano extract white soap and the original one all right um by the way i'm not going to be doing a detailed content on kojic sun soap because i already spoke about kojic sun soap in one of my videos i spoke at length about it so i'm going to be leaving the link of that particular video in my description box so please go ahead and check it out now let's just dive into it first of all what is kojic sun soap kojic sun soap is a very good soap it's a lightning soap that helps to you know um, remove freckles from your skin, removes hyperpigmentation, remove dark spots from your skin. It has a very strong lightening component and it has antioxidant properties. Okay, so this particular Kojic Sun Soap is actually very, very good for people that do not have sensitive skin. For example, I have sensitive skin, so I cannot use Kojic Sun Soap. But I can tell you for a fact that if you don't have sensitive skin, this soap is a soap you want to use on your skin. Now let's just go straight into what nano extract white soap is. Nano extract white is of two um, flavors. There's nano extract white natural papaya and carrot. There's nano extract white glutathione, kojic acid, and abutin. So you want to know the one you want to go for. Having these two doesn't mean one is fake or one is original. All right, that is not how to identify the fake from the original. At the end of this video, I will show you guys how to identify the fake nano extract white soap and the original extract white soap. Please watch the video till the end. Now let's just focus on nano extract papaya and carrot soap. Nano extract papaya and carrot soap is actually a lightning soap just like Kojic Sun soap. It's a lightning soap, no cap about it. If you're looking for something that is not going to lighten your skin, do not use this particular soap because if you're a dark person, like dark dark person and you want to use the soap because everybody is using it or because the media is talking about this particular soap you are going to have discoloration so i'm going to tell you not to use this particular soap if you have dark skin color it is for people that have um fresh skin that want to lighten their skin you know it's going to definitely lighten your skin up it's going to remove freckles from your skin it's going to remove dryness from your skin it's going to moisturize and hydrate your skin this particular soap is also going to remove hyperpigmentation and dark spots from your skin i will call this particular soap everything in all and the fact that it has papaya in it oh my god for me personally anything that has papaya in it is oh a go-to for me i always go for anything that has papaya in it so i love nano extract white soap and the fact that it's actually mild compared to kojic acid you're already doing comparison small small it's a go-to for me personally it's a go-to for me all right now hmm you need to also understand the fact that this particular soap has extract from carrots. So you you know carrots is actually carrots itself is good. Carrots itself is is magical. It's good for anti aging. It's it's going to make your skin brightening. You know it's it's actually really really good. Like so so good. And it has other um nice ingredients. It has vitamin A, B, C, D, E, and F. So it has so many um potency that makes the soap really really good and it doesn't have any comp any chemical components in it so you are safe and you're good to go all right without wasting much time let's just dive into the differences between kojic sun soap and nano extract white soap one is that nano is cheaper than kojic sun soap take it from me i did not say nano i said nano precisely <laughs> It sounds like Dano. Nano is cheaper than Kojic Sun soap. Kojic Sun is like 4,000, I think 42. One is like 2,000 Naira, if not more. So um, Nano is like 700, 1,000 Naira. So if you're looking for, if you're trying to cut your pockets and you're looking for something that is actually very affordable, you would like to go for Nano soap because Nano is more cheaper than Kojic Sun soap. Another thing to look out for is that Nano is 
much more mild than Kojic Sun Soap. Nano is mild. Kojic is stronger than Nano, okay? So for someone that has sensitive skin, you can still go for Nano and drop Kojic. If you're trying to, you know, think of the one to choose, probably you're in a supermarket and you find yourself, you know, seeing those two soaps staring at you, I don't know the one to choose and you have sensitive skin. I would advise that you go for Nano Soap, all right? Someone that has a strong hyperpigmentation on your body or your skin and you want to, you know, and you're thinking of the one to go for Kojic Sun has more potency to treat hyperpigmentation than Nano Soap. That is just the fact. Kojic Sun Soap has more potency than Nano Soap to treat hyperpigmentation. So some people even use Kojic Sun Soap to treat hyperpigmentation under their armpits. That is to show you how strong and effective Kojic Sun Soap is. All right. So you can use Kojic Sun Soap for more effectiveness when it comes to clearing hyperpigmentation compared to nano soap if that makes sense all right another difference i tried to add up to my list is that kojic um, nano soap has papaya kojic sun doesn't except you want to use the kojic papaya lotion for me i will go for nano because of the papaya in it anything that has to do with papaya is my go-to thingy like i love papaya oh my god I love papaya for my skin, all right? So, like I said, Nano has papaya, Kojic does it. Let's just go straight into the similarities of Kojic Sun Soap and Nano Extract White Soap. All right, the similarities between these two is that they both clear freckles, hyperpigmentation, and dark spots from your skin, all right? They all do that. Especially if you're a patient person, Nano would eventually clear hyperpigmentation from your skin it will do that ask anybody that has, that have used nano extract white soap before all right and was suffering from hyperpigmentation and that similarities is that this particular these two soaps will make your skin sensitive to sunburn so you want to imbibe your sunscreen i don't know anytime i come here i always mention sunscreen if you are new to my channel, you probably might not know that I always talk about sunscreen, but then I always talk about sunscreen a lot. So if you're using this soap, if you're using any of these two soaps, you need to use your sunscreen for you to see the effectiveness on your skin. If not, you just be telling me, ah, damn, Lola, how come my hyperpigmentation is not going? And I'm using Kojic, I'm using um, Nano. My dear sister, are you using your sunscreen? Show you the wine, mini. How do you expect it to go now, eh? Show you the wine, mini. <laughs> And last similarities is that these two soap, these two soap give you the lightening effects that you want. They both lighten your skin. So if you're looking for something to lighten your skin and you want to choose between nano and kojic acid, the both of them will lighten your skin. So just make your choice. All right. Make your choice, mama. Okay. So those are the similarities that I can give to you on my list. Now let's just dive into how to differentiate between nano extra twice soap original and the fake one the fake from the original i know this is a part some of you have been waiting for all right that's fine Note these three things if you want to buy nano extra white soap first of all you need to know that on the carton there's a pass written plus the plus should be written in black that is for the original the plus should be written in black color I'm repeating myself again. The plus should be written in black color, not blue, not red, nor purple, nor pink, nor any other color. All right. Anything aside from that, jackpot. Okay. So another thing you need to notice that when you even remove the soap from the from the pack itself, on the pack, the carton itself, right? You need to check out for expiring dates and manufacturing dates. Those two things need to be there. Expiring dates, manufacturing dates. Check out for those two things. All right, and the soap is made by the Philippines, just like the way extracts is made by the Philippines is made by the Philippines. If you go out here in Nigeria, made by the country, something Germany, taxes, well, Japa. All right, okay. Now, if you now want to remove it from the carton and you're open up from there, you can get to identify the fake from the original. When you remove the soap from the carton, it comes with a transparent plastic pack, a transparent plastic pack, like a transparent a nylon. Let me just put it that way. It comes with a transparent plastic pack. On that transparent plastic pack, there's an inscription on it that says original. And also, it shows you the year it was produced. The inscription says original. 
also the year it was produced my dear brothers and sisters those are the things you need to look out for those are the things you need to look out for so these are the three things that will help you identify the fake nano extract white and the original nano extract white okay are we on the same note baby girl are we on the same note all right we've come to the end of today's video that is all i have for you guys for now many more ask come don't forget to subscribe to my channel like my video turn on post notification give this video a thumbs up it's very very important give this video a thumbs up all right i love you all see ya bye